Halloween highlights the peak of fall each year with ghastly ghouls, crazy clowns, but most importantly, the trick-or-treating. Halloween's always a fun time of year. As a child, I remember you're looking forward to Halloween because you know you're going to get probably get a bunch of candy. As Southport's Parks and Rec director, Ellis is in charge of the annual trunk or treat. Normally our uh, trunk or treat would have 25 to 30 vehicles and they would have the trunks of their vehicles open and we would have a line of people coming through the park um, going trunk to trunk filling up their bags. This Halloween instead of going trunk to trunk or door to door for treats, Southport residents will drive through Chapel Park and receive their treats right here. So the event's going to be a pre-registration event this year. In total, we, we have 200 slots. People have to drive, remain in their vehicle, and then we'll have a bag full of treats and Halloween items that we'll place in the trunk of their car. To register, you must be a Southport resident, but it will be available to the public on October 19th if spots aren't filled. And although Halloween won't be the same this year, Ellis is staying positive. It's a time for us where maybe it won't be as hectic as life normally is with, you know, everyday life where people have school and sports and jobs, but maybe it'll be a time where we can actually focus on our family a little bit more and do things that maybe we wouldn't normally do or have time to do. For 18 News, I'm Elise Kim.